to a video you will only see here on Local 15 News. Seven students at Mary G. Montgomery High School were arrested after a fight broke out on campus. The mother of one of those students says her son is innocent and the video proves it. Tonight, we're seeing that cell phone video for the very first time. Dozens of students gather around to watch, including 18-year-old Dalton Dunn, who says he's the victim and not the attacker. If they're going to suspend me, I should be suspended for self-defense and not eight days and plus a mugshot, a record, all that just for self-defense. Dalton's mugshot is now public record. He was arrested for disorderly conduct. His mom says it's a bogus charge. Right is right, wrong is wrong. And if you're going to have a no-tolerance policy for one child, then it should apply to every child involved. It's grainy and tough to see, but in this video, Dalton is wearing a backpack and standing to the side. I should have been in class. I should have not watched the fight. But he did watch the fight and admits he eventually got involved only after he was punched. I get called to the office and uh, I get, they say I started everything. Dalton is now suspended for eight days, and his mom has filed a complaint against the Mobile County Public School Board. And was told that the appeal would be heard on his last day of suspension. Originally, the day of suspension, he, I was told that he would have three-day suspension. Then when I go back for the suspension uh, conference, they're giving him eight. She says school board members also have the video, and she's hoping they'll review it and clear his name. As for his Metro jail booking, she wants that cleared as well. He was doing what I believe as a parent was the right thing to do, and that was defend himself against their children. Uh, we reached out to the school board this afternoon. We are told it does not comment on pending litigation, but it is aware of the incident.